Understanding Bone Health and Osteoporosis. Osteoporosis is a disease that makes your bones weak and more likely to break. Every year in the United States, osteoporosis causes about 2 million broken bones. One in every two women and up to one in every four men will break a bone in their lifetime due to osteoporosis. Our bones are alive. Throughout our lives, our bodies are breaking down old bone and building new bone to replace it. This process is called bone remodeling. During our teen years, our skeletons grow rapidly. Until about age 30, our bodies build new bone faster than they remove old bone. Most of us reach our peak bone mass, the most bone we'll ever have, by the time we're 30. After age 30, we all slowly start to lose bone mass, breaking down old bone faster than we can build new bone to replace it. Our bones store most of the calcium in our bodies. Our bodies need calcium to build new bones and help our muscles, nerves, and cells work properly. Your body gets the calcium it needs in two ways. From food or supplements that contain calcium, or by borrowing calcium from your bones. If this isn't replaced, your body will make less new bone and over time your bones will get weaker. Osteoporosis is often called a silent disease. You can't feel your bones getting weaker. It happens slowly over many years. You might not know you have osteoporosis until you break a bone. Bone fractures due to osteoporosis can occur anywhere in the body, but they happen most often in the spine, hips, and wrists. Spinal fractures may cause gradual loss of height, stooped posture, and severe back pain. Some people have a higher risk than others for getting osteoporosis. Anyone can get osteoporosis, but it's most common in people over age 60. People who had a parent with osteoporosis or a hip fracture. Beginning around menopause, women are at higher risk than men for fractures caused by osteoporosis. The hormone estrogen helps a woman's body keep a balance between breaking down old bone and building new bone. But around menopause, the body starts making less estrogen. Bone loss speeds up when there's less estrogen in the body. Bone loss can be caused by another disease or by a medication. This is called secondary osteoporosis. Diseases that can cause bone loss include diabetes, kidney or liver disease, some types of cancer, eating disorders, losing too much calcium in urine, and an overactive thyroid gland. Many different kinds of medications may cause bone loss. These include medications used to treat cancer, diabetes, heartburn, and other diseases. Osteopenia means that your bones are thinner and weaker than normal. People with osteopenia are at high risk for developing osteoporosis. Some things that increase your risk for osteoporosis cannot be changed, such as your age, your sex, and your family history. But there are things you can do to prevent or slow down the bone loss that leads to osteoporosis. Eat a healthy diet that's rich in calcium. Many foods contain calcium, but dairy products have the most calcium per serving. Take calcium supplements if you find it hard to get enough calcium from food. Your body needs vitamin D to help it absorb calcium but it's hard to get enough vitamin D from food, so take a vitamin D supplement. Talk with your doctor about the daily amount of calcium and vitamin D that's right for you. Stay active. Physical activity helps keep your bones strong. Aim to be active for at least 30 minutes every day. Take care not to fall. If you have weak bones, falling can easily cause a fracture. Activities like Tai Chi or yoga can improve your strength and balance and help prevent falls. Both smoking and drinking alcohol can cause bone loss. If you're a smoker, talk with your doctor about quitting. If you choose to drink alcohol, don't drink too much. Making bone-healthy choices can help you keep your bones strong for life. <laughs>